You're watching this video because you're repairing a coupler on your RV sewer tank hose system. Well, we're doing the same thing and when we searched on YouTube for videos on this subject, we basically found nothing. We're making this video now in hopes that it's going to help you out if you're searching for the same repair to do on your RV. We bought a straight sewer coupler and if you're doing the same repair on your RV, we'll give you a quick link below that you can buy the part for yourself fast. Well, in a nutshell, everyone, the repair is going to be removing this old piece. It's cracking and leaking and we're gonna replace it with this brand new one. It's the fun that's gonna happen in between there that will probably make the video for you. Uh, we're not professional plumbers. You might see a little bit of that. Okay, so we've got the clamps mostly off. This feels loose already. I'm just gonna see how far I can move it without breaking something. I don't know how much play it's got in there. Oh, that works out, it's nice. So we're gonna now reach in here with our other hand and try to take this coupler off, which is nice and wet with super clean water. Sometimes I don't feel fresh even after a shower. Okay, there's the old one off, it's nice. Now probably the trick is gonna be getting the new one on and not touching my face. Right now, I'm loosening this off to try to make it easier for me to fit it in place and then I'll tighten it later. It's easier to use the socket than it is the screwdriver. So if you out there watching this have access to a little socket, use that over the screwdriver, but a screwdriver will work in a pinch. Okay, so this might be the fun part, boys and girls. Probably. I'm just trying to leverage it far enough to get this in here, which is not going so well. Maybe you need my little hands. We're close, man. We're like, mm -hmm. see that? Mm -hmm. Wiggle and jiggle. So lucky this thing is rubber. You can kind of work it until you get it to where it needs to be. We're almost there. Just getting my hands in around the back side to try to get it over the back lip here. Oh yeah, it still needs to unwrinkle here. There we go. I don't know if you heard that, but it just clipped in all the way around. And now we're going to try to bring these two pipes together. I'm gonna try to loosen that off a bit more. Just make sure it's on there all the way around, which it is. Okay, that needs to go on a lot more than it is right now. And on the inside of the coupler, that edging there, people have said that you can feel when the pipe hits that edge, but I don't know if you are able to. I don't know what that means. Right, see that little lip Yeah, inside? right. No, we're not even in. See, there's a gap right there. Okay. Look, it's still there, now we're in. Right. We are in there. So when, before we tighten this up, we're going to take another hand and we're going to snug it like that and then tighten it. Okay. We're going to just spin these so that it's going to be easier to work on with the socket. And you can start applying your pressure. Yeah. yeah okay. Feel the pipe getting snugger. Yeah. How's that? Give it a test. That's in there. Okay, that's a completed repair. I don't know if we got lucky, but a couple of laymen here with no real experience. That took probably Definitely under 15 minutes, maybe under 10. Things went pretty smooth outside of needing a little bit of a shower. That definitely could have been worse. So if you're intimidated by this repair, hopefully this video will help you tackle this 
uh, change out, it was really quite simple. We're hopeful that after seeing how simple this repair was, that you can have the confidence to tackle this procedure and save yourself the difference between you doing it and the shop rate. Where we're living now, in the time we're filming this video, I think shop rates for RVs are around 180, 185 an hour. And so I think this took us about 15 minutes. You'd save yourself at least a couple hundred bucks. So hope that helps you out. We're pretty close together here. It's our anniversary. <laughs> it is our anniversary. <laughs> You're the poop, honey. Yeah. So we thought it'd be romantic to change our <laughs> sewer hose uh, RV coupler on our anniversary because I'm, I'm kind of romantic like that. Oh. Anyway, I hope you found this video helpful. Hope it helps you out if you're doing a similar repair. And also in the, in the spirit of helping you out some more, we hope that this video here will be of value to you.